<clears throat> okay, I'm drinking a little bit, but I gotta say I'm not really that thirsty. It's just my mouth feels weird. But that brew I think that brewery hit my like my heart or something weird and made things feel like they're struggling for a moment. I, I smell the brewery over at over here at my car. I've never known a brewery to be dangerous, like the smell of the brewery to be dangerous. So I'm staring at this other car's broken mirror and I see that I finally noticed the motor hanging out. The motor hanging on the bottom there. I'm like, wow, maybe my mirror's got that too then. <laughs> it's just not exposed. All right, there's a very unusual smell in this spot. I'm a little nervous about, they're putting out a very unusual smell. The smoke is coming straight this way. I don't think I like it. So in Honey Creek Park, just down a little bit is some kind of ethanol plant and I smell it. And I also have this hornet that's really persistent in getting inside. I did leave the window open. Maybe not. Yeah, not all of it. Hi. Hi. Can we help you? Uh, is your Wi-Fi free? We do need to assign you in to use it though, so we'll need your That doesn't sound free. Pardon? That doesn't sound free to me. Do you, you not want you... to use it's like we're on the hub with the school, so it's like for illegal downloads and stuff, so where's the school? I didn't see a school around here. Is it it's across town? It doesn't sound like you're you have a proximity issue with them. Hub. You're the hub where we get us. Yeah, a lot of libraries, the Wisconsin libraries I've been in. Yeah, there it is, Lena Library. Mm -hmm. It's just an automatic sign-in, and you're saying that I have to. We got to give you the password. It was we there. What's your first and last name? We're not. We don't need. You well, know. what's your first and last name? Well, let's exchange that information then. My name's Kathy Andrews. Kathy Andrews. Dalrat. Okay. Well. Okay. <laughs> yes. Travis. Travis Hines. It's just that that was a request from them because there was a legal download, so well, we got. That, right. Hines? I don't. I don't understand the don't, hub, that's, hub thing. I. That's. You guys. You guys uh, are getting money from the school. The is that? The password is Dewey D O D E. I'm sorry. <laughs> that's you, D E W. You get. I can write it down. Oh. Please. Okay. Yeah. Watch your elbow. You right. guys. You guys must be getting funded by the li by the w school system, right? Well, yeah, we're a community district you library, know. and so yeah, our well, that, no. is the go. school district. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. They never got Did they ever call back about the rooms? No. no, not last night, so. But if that's it, then should I move? all these solar panels that Sullivan's got, you think the store is entirely powered by solar. <laughs> Gotta mow all the leaves. Catchable trout program. They got rainbow trout. Limit of five. No swimming. So how many rainbow trout get pulled under? If it's such a danger, why stock it with rainbow trout? Stocking a dangerous water with rainbow trout. See if my lock will still fight me. Look at that, it's, it's fighting me. It's locking the door.
I can't get out. Man, everything has changed color here, except for the evergreen. Kind of neat to see the oak changes into a red. Maple is a yellow. But then again, this oak is a yellow. Now my door's locking when I unlock it. Look at this. Okay. It locked. I didn't even lock it. So the children's play area. Mm -hmm. Right, Forreston, Forreston, uh, Illinois. Five, six, seven, oh, short of seven. Right in Polo, they must allow the UTVs and golf carts around the city and then limit them uh, from being in the parks. And then other cities are like, you can't even drive them on the streets in the city. All right, I think I'm going to end up taking this thing back. But uh, I had to try it in the parking lot. Got it from Hobby Lobby. I was just testing it inside the car. It lights up too much. It makes noise that I can't shut off. I don't, I don't want light and I don't want noise. <clears throat> So uh, apparently I, I hit this little, hmm, this little button on top to do something. Starts it up. Sorry. So I'm supposed to hold it level so it doesn't move. This goes back. This goes forward. Whoop. This goes to the side. Then I'm gonna I'm gonna hit this button. Whoop. And sometimes the wheel locks. I'm gonna hit this little button and uh, raise or and lower it. And then it'll do the same. It's just too noisy. Cause it, that engine noise is annoying. And the lights? Yeah, I don't... $32? I think I want my money back. So I was looking at this thing in the store and wondering if I could put my GoPro on top of it and just get some video that way, but uh, it's making all that noise and lighting and then lighting up. 
I like that it can go sideways, left and right lateral. That's pretty cool. That's the design of these wheels. But and then spins around. But uh, they added extra features. This is a Hobby Lobby exclusive. It even says um, Hobby Lobby. They're the they're the manufacturers of this. They they put put in too much. All right, I think I'm still in Sterling. This is well, where you throw a frisbee disc. And they got one, two, three, five of these cages lined up. It's like, this is a training area. I've never seen a training area like this. I don't really play the game, but I've noticed the different landscapes for, for it. 24? 175 but yeah they don't they don't really have a course but they do ha seem to have this this challenge to see how far you could throw I've been out here for quite a few hours I haven't seen anybody really play you know I think my sandals have been lasting a little bit longer because of my use of walking sticks a lot of times when I go through rough terrain because I went through all kinds of terrain that would make me like s slip to the side and uh, uh, compromise the, the sandal. I broke a sandal before stepping on an uneven surface and then slipping to the side and then the strap breaks. But I reduced that problem with, because uh, I catch myself a lot with the walking sticks, take pressure off the foot. So I preserve my sandals and I go through rough terrain with greater ease with my more extensive use of s sticks as opposed to just just only using my feet. When that branch finally breaks, the wire is going to lose its support. It's resting right on that branch for these, these poles. Thank God humans are here to help the wildlife survive. This is enough of a sign to scare me out of parking in the park. But they do allow you to park outside of the park. I'm over here at that dusk. You don't know what time and it's going to close. And it looks like it can close automatically. No, I do. I'm wanting to copy it from the paper tray, and every time there's no paper, it's so good to miss. Thank you. Can I help you? Oh yeah. Uh, is there a bathroom? It's downstairs. You can go outside to get to it? Yes. Okay. And also I see uh, on library guests there's a padlock. A, a what? Padlock. Like a, a P-A-D-L-O-C-K. Padlock. You ever hear, you know what they look like? Padlock? Yeah. Okay. Well I'll show you the picture of it then. This is a picture. Okay. You see a little padlock right there? Oh, that just means there's a, a password. It's just books on cook. Is it written or can I, I need to write that down? I got a couple of computers. Oh, you're writing that? Okay. Oh. 
Those are capitalized. All one word, no spaces. Okay. And then the, um, the bathroom is uh, on the outside, like to the left or the right? Yep. To the right, I'll have to unlock the door. Okay. So I'll go. Okay. Is this a Carnegie? It is. They put the bathroom outside. That's well, weird. Well, downstairs in our basement. That's, that's, that's how it was designed, is to yeah. have it outside? Okay. It's, a, it's all original. <laughs> okay. The lights are on the wall there to the left. Right to the left. Right up. Oh. There you go. <laughs> all right. Huh. So I gotta bring these eggs to a boil for a third time because they're not working very good on that steamer anymore in this cold. It's only getting down to the 40s, but uh, that's enough to prevent the um, eggs from cooking. And plus that glass top broke using the the blue, which isn't holding the heat in as, as well as the glass top, but still the cold is affecting cooking times. So they need to be in direct contact with water now. I can't be steaming them over the potatoes. They're separate deals now for the cold. I thought I was looking at a boat here really flat bottom boat canoe like but set up to put a motor on the back just sitting here in the park <clears throat> and over here this tree really had a break yeah it caused damage to the trailer probably a wind issue but it really looks like a weird break like oh my god oh my god i flip first i lose the shoe and then i then i flip it oh. oh it knocked over the tower did it knock over a tower too there's some kind of tower in between the trailers, maybe not. There's a tower over there. They took down the tower. Oh, and they got a ladder. And they got electrical. They took down the tower before the tree fell. <clears throat> hmm. All right, not far from my car. I do plan on going to Walmart, so look at this. Caden lost their, what? Oh, it got ran over. <laughs> the little clip thing broke. Oh my God, we got all kinds of, oh no, I thought they were identifying. No, white, injury, blue bomb, red fire, black tornado. Orange, brown acts of violence, orange, chemical spill, Adam, missing child. All on the back, oh, he's got a double badge, so you can't just flip it around. <laughs> That's good. That's what a lot of them, that's what they all need, a double badge, so they can't just flip it around and hide their name. These mushrooms grew a little high on the tree on a crack I don't think I'd ever put dog poop I don't know if I'd ever have a reason to put dog poop in my pocket but this guy over here did alright I'm getting some terrible leak that is happening in this section and I don't see how it's entering through the door I don't understand the path but there's a collection of water that soaked just everything in here after rain. 
It's just another spot where the leak is bad. It's still wet after a couple of days after the rain. It's a little frustrating. I don't, I gotta like keep a material there. I don't know what, but something that properly soaks it. Yeah, water's also getting in on the other side too. I'm just seeing now for the first time, it's very wet. So I gotta, I gotta soak up that water whenever it rains better. I need like sponges down here. I can see these weather strippings have uh, accumulated a lot of gunk, but I don't think the leaking is coming from the top dripping down. I think it's somehow forming at the bottom already because I think the top layer is protected. It's something that's seeping through the bottom, possibly through an open hole. I know water gets in the panel a little bit. It's just hard to tell the exact source. All right, I'm north of Paraya, and I gotta admit the vegetation looks a little different as I'm further south. Recognizable when I was in the further south. The vegetation has certainly gone through some changes. All right, I'm trying to prepare a little breakfast here. Some grass and a farm field I pulled to boil, which it did reach a boiling point and let it soak a little bit discolors the water and then i'll toss it and then i'm going to put in some muesli which i have put in some various herbs and i added some extra herbs to that muesli north of paroya illinois north of paroya illinois so I made sure to, yeah, this carpet is wet. It's wet on the towel, to, uh, the wool blanket. I got sponges in here. They're moist, a little moist. Just three sponges. I think I could use three more. Keep them right there to soak up all the water instead of fabric. Those are the best sponges I could find at Walmart, too. Instead of my leather glove soaking up, which uh, soaking up the water and getting mold, they're getting mold on them. These are not these are not cheap. It's a little disappointing to have mold on them, but I want to keep these sponges available to soak up that water instead. I'd rather sacrifice. I don't know. I don't even need so many gloves. I, it was just an experiment for a time. It's really not necessary. But I'd rather have the sponges soak up that water than the other stuff. I can't say I've really ever come across oak leaves that are bigger than my hand. I'm only used to smaller oak leaves. I come down south into Illinois and I'm running into some massive leaves. That's different to me. Looks like even the maple leaves are massive, too. Some kind of vegetation uh, uniqueness around here. What's up? Hey, who are you?
What do you mean? Who are you? I live around here. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Why don't you go find a new place to go? All right, I feel like I might benefit from another hole. Put the middle finger in when I try to handle my car seat. So I might be doing that for the other holes. Yeah, this one, I still gotta get deeper. It's a lot of hole drilling going on on the sides. I think it should stay strong enough still. While I was sleeping in here, some of my water turned to ice. All right, I broke down and bought one more sleeping bag. One more, because I'm not confident that I'll find another one in the woods soon enough. It's so chilly. This all got frosted over. I bought more uh, sponges because it's so so wet on the roof the ceiling i want to take care of that i already have sponge sponges sitting in the in the spots where water pools but the, i also want to wipe down i want to have some for wiping reusable Free Halloween costume swap shop. They got a ton of Halloween costumes here. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Alright, so I got a little idea here with these, what I want to do with these letters. I'm thinking I'm just going to hold on to these letters. And if needed, if my car ever breaks down on the side of the road, I'll try to paste, I'll make a little sign saying something like, car broke down. I want to communicate that immediately. I just don't know how I would uh, post it. I don't want to stick it to my car. Have some kind of a poster board in here, something I can stick those letters to, and then put them on my car to communicate that. Let people know why I'm on the side of the road. That's the reason, car broke down. Uh, but, uh, you know, I don't want, I don't think I need to post anything saying why I'm parked on the side of the road when the car is perfectly fine. But I'm more desperate if the car is actually broken down and I want to communicate that. Panhandling is unsafe in median. Well, in my experience with the uh, southern 
Best Buys, they have a lot of missing products, empty shelves. It's kind of ghetto. So if I want to have that lens mod too, I don't think I'm going to find it at any Best Buys from here on south. I don't think they really um, have good management. I don't think there's a good chance at any of the Best Buys to have good management.